Hello, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to my bedroom and today I have such an exciting video for you as we all know Valentine's Day is coming up and whether you celebrate Valentine's Day with a significant other or if you celebrate it with your friends you do a Galentine's Day I think it is still a great occasion to dress up feel a little sexy, romantic and I thought this would be a nice video for me to show you what I would wear for Valentine's Day and kind of give you a few options but it's not just any outfits, I will be wearing lingerie. I feel like there is no better occasion to wear lingerie than on Valentine's Day. Lingerie is so beautiful, it looks so good, I personally buy it because it makes me feel good, but then you never get to wear it, obviously it's not uh, work appropriate. But Valentine's Day I feel like is an occasion that really fits to wear it out in a more classy way, but it's still sexy and romantic. Anyway, I think it fits the occasion really good, which is why I'm doing this video where I'll be showing you five different lingerie outfits for Valentine's Day. If you like any of the outfits, let me know down in the comments below and uh, let me know what you will be wearing for Valentine's Day and what you will be doing. But now, without further ado, let's go and get started with the video. Okay, for the first outfit, I actually chose something that I have worn before. And I feel like red is just such a typical Valentine's Day color and I love this pantsuit. I have to admit it is not the most uh, actual silhouette. Uh, the pants could be a bit more loose fitting and the blazer can be a bit more oversized but this suit is like three or four years old. But I still love it and I feel like pairing it with lingerie underneath is just so classy, elegant but at the same time it is still sexy and I paired it also with uh, these heeled booties which makes the outfit comfortable um, and yeah as you can see from the close-up I added some nice golden earring hoops and some golden jewelry that I actually wore throughout the whole um, video because I just felt like it was a very good choice underneath the bodysuit I added a, a bra so of course it wouldn't be see-through because just it's not something that I feel comfortable with. But anyway, as you can see, the bodysuit is really nice. I love the lace, I love the color. Uh, on its own, I feel like it's a little bit too open, but when you put a blazer on top, it's just uh, perfectly covers everything up and you have these small, sexy details on top. Overall, I love this outfit. I feel like it is very feminine. You can always add a little red lip, put your hair up and down, add a beautiful bag and you're ready to go. It is not too cold, it is weather appropriate and perfect. Okay, let's go on to outfit number two. For this outfit, I chose to keep the same bodysuit on as I feel like it's just uh, super sexy and black fits with everything. But this time I paired the bodysuit with uh, black jeans and a white uh, oversized shirt and I left it open because of course I want to show the bodysuit. And I chose different kind of booties that have a higher heel um, because I feel like they're very flattering and of course if we're going out on a date we want to be a little bit more dressed up. But yeah, as you can see the bodysuit is the same. I really really love it and I also like the contrast between black and white. I chose to keep the same jewelry and I don't want to put any necklaces or anything on because sometimes less is more so I don't want to overdo it with the jewelry because the bodysuit is the attention of the outfit. But again you can add a red lip to this outfit, a nice bag, kind of customize it depending on how you like to have your hair and again I feel like this is very nice Valentine's Day outfit and it is also very comfortable so you will feel sexy, confident and comfortable. All right, let's go on to the outfit number three, which is very different for me and I haven't worn anything like this before, but I felt like experimenting and I actually really like the look. And I have to say from the beginning that the outfit is very comfortable. So as you can see, I kept the same black jeans on and I took an oversized white t-shirt, very simple, very comfortable. And I put on a black corset top on top of it. Uh, and as you saw just right now, it is really hard to put it up yourself. So if you have anyone that can help you, that is a great bonus. At the time of the filming, I didn't have anyone, so I just had to leave it open. But anyway, you can still see how it looks. I kept on the same black booties and I just feel like it's such a nice and relaxed outfit, but still sexy. And uh, of course it's still lingerie and you can show it off. You can show your black leather bra off. And uh, yeah, I kept this on the same jewelry. I would add again a red lip just to make the 
outfit a bit more colorful, maybe a red bag, but overall I absolutely love it and it is definitely something that I'm considering wearing on our Valentine's date. Uh, so yeah, let me know what you think about it. Outfit number four. I'm really excited for this one because I absolutely love this bralette. It's from Victoria's Secret. I also got it like four or five years ago, but I've been wearing it consistently just because I love the color, I love the fit, and uh, especially in the summer, it just pops really good. You can definitely wear this bralette just with the pants as I'm showing you here now. But personally, I feel like it's a little bit too naked. Also, it is February and I live in Germany, so it's just going to be too cold. So I paired it with this black blazer, which is actually my favorite blazer. And you will for sure see it in many other videos because I use it a lot. And uh, I chose to put it kind of on top of the shoulders, you know, this Instagram look. Um, and it gives a little bit more of an elegance to the outfit. And again, it keeps you warm. I absolutely love it. I paired it again with black booties because I just feel like if you're going on a date, why not wear a heel? And yeah, I just love the pop of uh, pink and black. Um, and I again feel like it's very Valentine's Day appropriate. And last but not least, outfit number five. I absolutely love it again. I think I say it about every outfit, but that's why I choose them. Yes, this is a bit more summery and um, I just wanted to wear this bralette again because did I mention that I love it? And I also really like the skirt and I feel like this pink and blue combination together looks so good and it's so feminine. It makes me wanna touch my skirt all the time, twirl around. And as I mentioned, since it is February and it can be cold, I would add a black jacket on top. Ideally, I would add a leather jacket, but unfortunately I don't own any, but this one is very close to it and I feel like it just gives a little bit of an edge and I would pair it with black combat boots. And again, I love the color combination. It just looks good, it's elegant and it's comfortable. So yeah, uh, did you also realize how difficult it is to give voiceovers because I just feel like I have to say the same thing about every single outfit. Anyway, let's go to my closing thoughts and uh, thanks for watching. So this was such a fun video to film once again. I just feel like I'm having so much fun with uh, all these different outfits. Let me know what other outfits you wanna see, what occasions should I give you outfit ideas and inspirations on, if you want me to visit any shops, you know, I'm really open for all of the suggestions. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching and I will be happy to see you again in another video next week.